I've been doing this network marketing thing for about 11 years now. And a lot of you are looking at me going, how old I Hey, everybody. Hope everyone's having a phenomenal Friday. Um, I'm actually coming to you live today. Dan Zyka here, Fraser, Michigan. This is my hometown, so I'm excited to be back and spend a little time here in my hometown and been all over the place the last few weeks, all, driving all over Michigan, down to Florida, and everywhere in between. But I wanted to shoot a quick video today and uh, talk a little bit about an article that I read this morning from Forbes magazine. Now, if you're not familiar with Forbes, you should familiarize yourself with it, first of all. But if you are familiar, you already know that that is the foremost uh, authority on wealth in America, basically, from a magazine standpoint, a website standpoint. They do the big Forbes uh, top 50 list every year, top 10 list, the wealthiest people in the world. And they were actually talking, interestingly enough, about network marketing today. And uh, if you, you know, the link is on my page here, if you, on my Facebook page, so find it and read it for yourself. However, there's two major groups, guys, right now that are really driving the uh, network marketing industry, okay? The first group is the baby boomers. We've all heard about the baby boomers. That's the generation born from 1946 to 1964. We all know it's a huge demographic. They have a, a lot of money. They have a, they control a lot of the money, not have a lot of money, but they control a lot of the money because they're the ones that have been working for the last 40, 50, 60 years and have savings accounts and all that fun stuff. So really, and, and, and they're looking for a way to retire, but still remain relevant. And network marketing gives you purpose. It gives you identity. It gives people something to look up for, you know, look up to, strive for, wake up in the morning, have something to do. Now, the other demographic that I believe is huge and it's underestimated is the millennial demographic, okay? That's us, all right? I'm 28 years old. Those are people that are now 18 to 34, I believe, is the, the demographic age range, but roughly that's the number, you know, and there's millions and millions and millions of people that fall in that demographic that you know, did all the right things they were supposed to. They went to school, they got, you know, the degree, they got the good jobs, or try to get the good jobs rather, and it never really worked out for them, okay? So that's a huge demographic that you as a marketer, as a networker, should sharpen your skill set, get better, go out there, get to these people and show them that there is a better way out there to make a living and they don't have to go out and beg for a $9, $8 an hour job that they really hate and don't really wanna wake up and, and go to in the morning. So I just wanted to get that out there to everybody. Uh, one big important thing uh, for tomorrow, this is tomorrow, Saturday, December 13th. We have a huge, huge meeting. This is for my team specifically, not for anybody else. Uh, but if you guys would like to attend, you're welcome to as well. We're gonna be at the Detroit Marriott Southfield tomorrow, right off of Northwestern Highway. And we're doing a huge training event. We're actually going to have my mentor there, Mr. Bill Hoffman, is going to be in the house. We're excited for that. Our uh, national or, or national trainer slash uh, executive vice president of training, uh, Paul Stowers, is also going to be in the house. And our new new national manager, uh, Ian Hoffman, 19 year old phenom. This guy is just knocking it out of the park right now. He's kind of like a little brother to me, but I always challenge him and, and want to want to outdo him because he's younger than me and I've been doing this longer, but he's having a lot more success than I have at this point within this company, but we're getting there. We're catching up. So, uh, we're, we're also challenging team Supreme of Philadelphia, team shield of Detroit challenge team Supreme of Philadelphia, that we would have the biggest week in the company's history this week. We're taking our title back as the fastest grown team in the company. So that being said, I hope everybody has a blessed day. Get out there, make it happen. Find those baby boomers and find those millennials and, and let's show them the best way to, to go out there and make a living, make a difference. So take care. Have a great one.